Please join me and Congresswoman Sanchez in presenting the Hispanic Heritage Award for Vision, Rosario Dawson. Que volá. I've been so nervous about this all night. Um, my grandmother is here, Isabel II. My mother is here, who I'm sure you've all met at some point, Isabel Salete. And I recognize that I'm only here because of them. And, um, and that's what we're here for, is to recognize our heritage and to understand that the steps and the strides that we are able to make with ease and sometimes hardship comes from the shoulders that we have stood on to get there. And I'm really glad that they were able to be here with me. And I'm really glad that they gave birth so early that we were all so young to be able to enjoy it so well together. <laughs> and I've been, I was bemoaning the fact today that I'm 28 and I just it was not one of those girls who got, had five kids already and I'm all upset about it because then we'd be four generations here tonight. So I got to marry someone who has kids so I could get on that real quick, okay? Let's work on that. I'm single. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> um, that's not where I was trying to bring the conversation. <laughs> hands down. <laughs> I want to see hands up for people who are committed to making a difference in not only their lives, but our youths. Thank you. I, um, I, 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 ju I jumped on the Hispanic Heritage uh, site today to see what was kind of just going on in general, the things that I wasn't catching or what was missing, and I saw that Wilmer was actually going to be here, and I had seen him last night, and he got an award for a Leadership Youth Award, um, which was really, really powerful, and it reminded me, this is, this is what we're here for. He said some really beautiful things about recognizing that it's not about just saying, coming up here and going, thank you so much, and, and getting excited about the idea, the spectacle of it, but the reality, the weight of what this is. And I really respect that, and I take that really strongly, receiving this award tonight. Because vision is not about just the achievements that I've had today, it's about the idea that I can see more, and that I'm willing and committed to continue to move forward with my hopes and my goals and my ideas, ideas and my dreams. And I know that comes because we're going to do that as a community of people. As an individual, I live hard, I play hard, I, I work hard. But I know that the legacy that I'm going to lead is the leave is going to be what I've done to affect other people and the people who have done that with me. So I want to recognize Maria Teresa Peterson, who is our executive director of Voto Latino who is an amazing guiding light for this organization and the reason why it is still up and running and doing so beautifully. Thank you so much. Um, I want to recognize Steve Alfaro, who's got our website going, votolatino.org. He is one of our young professionals who are on our advisory board, and that's what it's about. It's all about the fact that as people, we can move together and have a movement. And movements are long-lasting, as Maria Teresa says. So here we are, together, making a movement, committed. Antonio, thank you so much at the Hisp Hispanic Heritage Foundation for being a supporter. And also, congratulations on your baby. You now have a baby boy and a baby girl. Family name and family beauty. You have done your duty, as my mommy says. Um, I want to thank uh, Brendan Hernandez at PG&E. We're our key sponsors, the only reason why we're still up here today. I want to thank MTV, Naleo. Um, all the different people, the community of people who have made it possible for me to be accepting this award today. Thank you so much. And please continue forward with the vision with me that as a community, we are unstoppable. <laughs> unstoppable. And we look good doing it too. Damn. So thank you very much for this award and continue to do this every single day, every single step. Know with pride that you are making a difference, that you are making changes and you are making this world a better place because that's what it's here for, right? I mean, it's nice to be here right now, but at some point I'm going to be standing hopefully in the same position as my grandmother and my mother is right now, looking up at my future that I've created. And that would be really beautiful. And I'm happy and hopefully making them as proud as they've made me. So thank you very much.